Okay, we're, we're recording right now. Just give me a pink slip. All right. All right. We'll dramatize. Either. Oh, all right. We can, let's be actors. <laughs> There's nothing pink around here. There you I saw one. We're actors. Okay, I'm going to call hard Rumble. Let me back up a little bit. All right. Say what you got to say. We're actors. This sounds real good on this mic. I was wondering how come I couldn't hear it on the other earphone, but I found this is a mono. Mono, mono. Oh, look at All right. May I please have Hart Roman in? Why am I still recording when there's nobody here? This is boom, boom. Yeah, boss. Having doing? a pretty good show, huh? Yeah, really. Coolness. Excellent show. Listen. All these people on the wall of fame. Yeah, we're, we're doing jealous interviews of you. left and right. We can't get the artists ourselves. 1994 here. is here. I figure I'm in if effect. we get rid of you, I can get the artist for myself. So. Wait, get rid of me? Yeah. What is this? Merry Christmas. Oh, cool. It's a Christmas card. A Christmas card. Man, Tracy. Ho, ho, ho. For a get out go. the dough. <laughs> <laughs> ho, 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 get out the dough. Is your idea of a joke? Yeah. Oh, it is? Yeah. Oh, good. So, I, yeah, for a minute there, I thought it was fire. Wait until I sign it. <laughs> It'll be official. Good thing I'm not fired because if this were. <clears throat> and, ooh. If this were a notice. <laughs> if this were a, If this were a notice that I was telling you I was getting fired, that would mean. That today would be my last show. That today would be my final Sunday afternoon special. Harv, it is your last show. Sure is. What, what do you mean? Today is your last show. But the ratings! 30 watts? No, no, Harv, the ratings. Oh, really? Is it that bad? <laughs> yes. Worse than the Bears? <laughs> Worse than the Bears. <laughs> So I guess this is it. Worse than the Redskins. I guess this is it. I, I guess today is my last show. I guess. We figure we're going to change the formula. We're going classical. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, there's only one thing left to do. I'm going to take off my WCYC jacket. <laughs> I'll take off my other WCYC jacket. And... I'll put on my WCYC t-shirt for one final time. This will be it. The final Sunday afternoon special. Either the show will suck or it'll be good, but no matter which way it goes, it'll be the end. We're doing a video drama. <laughs> He's looking at us like we're nuts. Uh, can so, you please sign security just in case? Security? <laughs> Did somebody shut that TV down? <laughs> well, we're, I'm an actor. Well, he's actor man. <clears throat> my last duty as a radio host here at WCYC would be to have a radio show. But before we do that, let me show you around these fine studios for the final time. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, our other actor, Tony Boom Boom Bade, he is he is an actor. And Extraordinaire. <laughs> that was a sitting ovation for Tony Boom Boom. Well, uh, this is the portable that I record all my shows on. I won't be needing this anymore. Uh-huh. Is that about punk? This is where we get our news. It's very, it's, it's incredible how we get our news here. We hit the bar space. Oh, there is no news. It's no news today, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta hit it cold. No, no, it's, it's supposed to... <coughs> somebody goofed it up. Somebody's he shut the TV off. So, somebody... <laughs> Oh, there's the news. See, now, if I wanted a story, like, look, Sandoval shot. Watch it be somebody I know. See? Police were questioning a suspect who may have critically shot a teenage boy Sunday morning. Rafael Sandoval of an unknown, where was he? He was at 1658 South Troops. That's right around here. It's another reason why it's my last show. I hate this neighborhood. It was a gang-related shooting. So that's how we got our news during all this time. I watched my wrestling over here. Ooh, it's 12.04. Um, I'll tell you what. We'll take a quick walk. We'll go outside and show the building. I'll show you the spot where somebody spray painted Harv sucks. <laughs> and then, we're gonna do radio. I threw my jacket on the floor with a camera in it. That, that was stupid. Uh-huh. But, you made it smart. Aren't you, you gonna, know, aren't you gonna mention the guy who's videotaping it? Oh, that's right. Brighton, long time friend? Brighton Park Dave, long time friend, man. <laughs> blew each other off for a while. I'll take a picture of Brighton Park Dave as he videotapes the last Sunday afternoon special. <laughs> We were in grade school together. 
Yeah, we knew each other since third grade. Met him. Oh, I thought it was sixth grade. No, it was third grade. You were in, you were knocked up by some fat. It was a missing from. <laughs> So Let's Dave's see. videotaping, and he's on the other side of the camera, which, which stinks because you can't see him. <laughs> Dave was here for the first broadcast in January 1986 of all that morning stuff. It was Gloria Roca, Jesse Roca, Dave Linwood, Harv Roman, Jennifer Rivera. That was it, right? Yeah. And Tony, and we played Tony's Mix that day. Come on. All right, let's go. This. Don't fall. All right. <clears throat> I got to see what I'm walking. All right. All right. Wall of Fame, throughout the years, various recording artists and actors like Tony <laughs> have been in the studio and been interviewed by the Harvester. Got famous people like George Lopez, who was on Showtime just yesterday. George Lopez. Pretty good show. Cynthia April, April, who I just talked to on the phone a little while ago. George Lamond, I was the first one ever to interview him and play his music. Marcus Lopez, Tony Moran. There's all kinds, all kinds of people on this famous Wall of Fame. The other neat thing about the Wall of Fame is they've been stealing pictures. TK used to be here, he's gone. Fast forward. Very. I'm just hitting the wall. Don't mind me. No, it's, it's okay. I just hit the wall. Oh, I thought you were. And I was saying goodbye, pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you kiss the pictures? The other half, the Wall of Fame. Yep. More famous people that have been through these studios and been interviewed by the Harvester. John Leguizamo, Mambo Mouth, Spicarama, Whispers in the Dark. I interviewed him. Malcolm Jamal Warner, Theo of the Cosby Show. I interviewed him. Judy Torres. The Cover Girls. Yes, yes, I interviewed them. Matter of fact, I had an interview once with the Cover Girls. They blew me off. Where's the Cover Girls? Right down here, the Cover Girls. That's, that's um, Angel. Caroline and Margo, but you didn't know that. They're pretty hot. This is my claim to fame right here. I'll tell Law about this. See, Law? My claim to fame right here on George Lamont's first album, Bad of the Heart. He gave me an album credit right there. Harv Roman, WCYC. They mentioned no other Chicago people, but they mentioned me. That's beautiful. You're hitting it. And that song, that song that's on the radio, that's April. I was just talking to her. Well, Tunisia, there's just so many. And some of these pictures have been ripped off. That's a beautiful thing. Andre de Monte, yes, he never came up with a record, but he came up with a picture. <laughs> I'm supposed to host this party too, but they decided not to put my name on the poster because my oh, show was canceled. <laughs> your other uh, well, after today, that sign's going to say off the air with Harvard. Boom, <laughs> hit me on the door. Right. Off the air, okay. It'll say off the air. If it says on the air now, all right, guy. Ah, that's the. Ooh, this is the last schedule my name will be a part of. See that? Where it says Sundays, Sundays, Sundays. Mm -hmm. Sunday afternoon special, Harv Roman. Erase that. The Harvester is gone. Put an X. <laughs> want to buy a pen? You want my pen? Oh, remember this, David? Mornings are fun with Harv Roman and company oh, on 90.5 yeah. of that. <laughs> that was cool. That's gone. So let's let's take Harv out of the um out of the thing here. The harvester is gone. All right, put it back here. I want we'll we'll look at the outside of the building, and then we'll do some radio because that's why we're here. It's the final broadcast. This is right. law. No gang stands sense, for yeah. love and wisdom. <laughs> so, yeah, I did my homework. You're a smart guy. You went to school. <laughs> The new management got a pop machine. See, what I couldn't do as a program director, they did, and that's why I'm gone and they're here. They got a pop machine. That's cool, man. And here's another nice little indication of how things are going here at good old 90.5 FM. <laughs> Everything here, puro espanol. Todo aquí está en espanol. And it didn't used to be that way. Mm -hmm. I envisioned a day when 90.5 FM is pure Spanish. That's probably why I get rid of it. They didn't even make me an ornament. Everything in Spanish. Feliz, Merry, Navidad, Nas. All right. Well, Dave. I feel like I'm on a Dave Letterman show. We'll take a look at the outside of the building. Uh -huh. And we'll come back up and do some radio. It's my own version of Street Mix. <laughs> the hallway. Harold, this used to be Harold's office. Harold's dead. But he's, he's going to be listening today. <sighs> All right, we'll go downstairs and... There was a dead mouse on that floor once. I love this hallway. It is so acoustically correct.
<laughs> one pile of wood, the old for the bathroom, for the bathroom. It's a conference room, but it's not a conference room. You gotta do this, man. My tape's gonna run out. I just wanna see the outside of the building, folks. How are you gonna go down the stairs with your video TV? What? Can you, can you go down the stairs safely? Yeah, you can do that. I can do that, no problem. Come on. We're just going down the hallway. This is final, probably the final time we'll be going up and down this hallway. Car got fired. Now there's a security system, so I can't come back. Oh, boy. Wow, oh, it's crowded downstairs. There's guess, Romero Brown on the phone. Is, We're waiting to Romero. I guess everybody's here to see you. Yeah, they're, they're, all, they're all here to see you. Ooh, a penny. Ah! Take a penny, you might get good luck. You might get the job back. What is it, 19? <laughs> 19. can't read this. 84? Oh, that was about two years before you started. I started here in 86, that's right. Ah, this is it. All right. This is a little village boys and girls club. This is where it all started. And this is where it's all ending. Now, if you look closely, this is where it said Harv sucks. It said Harv sucks. And somebody put that on the building. Somebody put that on the building. I don't know who that is that's beeping. Somebody put that on the building during one Puerto Rican event. And I admitted on the air that I was Puerto Rican. And the next Monday, Harv sucks. Was on this building. One, the other thing about this neighborhood that's beautiful is all the gangbang. If you if you just pan over there, Dave from Brighton Park, see all that gangbang? I don't have to worry about that anymore because I'm not going to be around here anymore. Somebody's beeping and somebody's back. I don't know who these people are. Oh well. This is it. 28th and Ridgeway. This is where it all started. 2801 South Ridgeway Avenue. Me and Maria Gaitan, who's Brighton Park's Dave's woman. <laughs> and I introduced her. She's gonna send you your panties. I introduced, <laughs> Dave. I I say introduced that. Dave to his girlfriend. I introduced Tony to his girlfriend. And I can't get a girlfriend. Well, that's it. The antenna. Can we see the antenna from here? The Is antenna? It important to see the antenna? No, that's not important. It's up there, okay? It's up there. What we're gonna do now is go upstairs and do some radio. And this would be the last Sunday afternoon special. Let's turn this camera off. Tell me, tell us what are you doing for your last day as uh, getting prepared for this uh, last event. Doing the same thing I've done for the last eight years, dude. Except I used to bring in all my records. Uh -huh. I carry them with me. Right. People started stealing my records. So put everything on cassette. Bada bing, bada boom. I'm all set. Everything's on cassette. So I'm just preparing for broadcast in the background. That's the boomer's tape. What material are you going to do for your last day? Well. There's a whole new exciting group out of Waukegan, Illinois, coming in town. Uh -huh. They call themselves Law. It stands <clears> for Love and Wisdom. Am I doing my homework, boys? Yeah, you sure yeah. did. <laughs> I ran into uh, one of their flyers at the Alcatraz. It was a phone number, and I called the number. I heard a song, and it killed. I decided they're going to be guests on my show. Hey, so they're going to be here. Actually, I'm going to talk to Tony first. I'm going to fade it. Hi. I'm Harv. Today's my last day. I was program director for five years, and in five minutes, Bobo said, wait, that's, I don't know who that is. I don't know who it is. From the Spanish program? She's with the Spanish. She's with Radio Juvenil. The first call on my last show. WCYC Radio. Okay, pero habla español? No. Nope. ¿No speak Spanish? ¿Y no hablas? Sí. A little bit. Okay. What happened to our program at Spirit Gonzalez? It's gone. Hay otro programa ahora. ¿Eh? Todo está cambiando aquí. Todo está cambiando ahí. Sí, hoy es el, el último día mía, mío tam, también. El último día de usted también. Uh. Sí. Ahora en 94 todo está todo está cambiando. Pues pongan algo bueno. <risa> 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 